Yes, this is sensational, by the way. Yeah, we'll see you. <laughs> Check out that hair. For those that don't know, Seth cut his hair. That that hair oh. is sick. I would I say like that it. I would say that hair is just as sick as his old hair. Yeah, I it's agree. Just different. It's on par. But it's like equal levels of sick. There it is. Get your first glimpse. And then of course, uh, Estrella. Ohio Samus. Really good Samus. Also, just really chill. Dude Underrated in general. He is. I can see you and him getting along. He we do. He, he went <laughs> too in depth on his gameplay for me to follow along. <laughs> Where I was like, all right, all right, chill. But he was like, he was feeling pretty pretty emotional about his his loss. So I just let him, I just let him work it. Yeah. Which is fine. I don't mind it. It's just like I couldn't really like have a conversation. I know he just let it out. So, this is where we're going to see the mind game of Samus charging up and how the two players respond. Right. So far, Estrella twice, anytime Seth approached, he did a backwards jump. And that's all he did. He waited for Seth to do something. So, he's a patient player. The charge shot is really what makes Samus as a character. Um, when does. the charge shot is charged, she becomes a better character uh, because... You're more intimidated. Like, you either yes. have to choose yeah. to respect Charge Shot, which gives her options that she didn't before because you're forced to give her more space. Right. Or you have to not really play with as much regard for Charge Shot, but then risk getting hit by it, which is terrifying. Not just hit by it, but embarrassingly hit by it, right? Like, <laughs> and of course, there's a middle ground between those two, but it just it, it gives her, it makes her a lot more flexible and able to deal with situations easier when you're threatened by this super terrifying yeah, <sighs> move like that. That's it's the second time Seth has retreated a, 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 unsafely. And I got hit by the charge shot. And the other terrifying thing about charge shot is that it's powerful on the ground and in the air. Yeah. So it's totally a disadvantage tool as well. Up the, yep. Oh, that was fantastic. Oh, and uh, Estrella looking up in the air. Yeah, they're like, man. Th th that's kind of that option that you just don't oh. think about. <laughs> because um, in most matchups, if you're sitting on a platform like that in shield, you're like, all right, yeah. come up, hit my shield so I can kind of like... I can kind of like back off, get off the platform at least. Um, but Falcon definitely has an answer to people who are comfortable sitting in shield. But note that the next two times on the platform, oh. that Australia was on the platform, Seth did attacks rather than the up B, assuming that Australia was going to jump out of shield, but he didn't. Mm -hmm. um, so he kind of made sure. Yeah. He's like, you're going to stay in that shield, I'm going to up B you again. Yep. Kind of testing the waters a little bit at first. And right. Made use of the data. Gotta close out the stock. Australia getting a little desperate with his upbeat. I, I did like that upbeat though because he knew he would be able to safely go to the ledge without that's risk of true. dying. Yeah, that's big. Um, a lot of the time with upbeats like that, there are platforms or ledges that can save you. Good air dodge from Australia. There are a yeah. lot of characters that are able to short hop air dodge back here. I think it's a little bit of an underrated option because it can beat out um, like those more aggressive burst options like that. Yeah, that was a bit uh, ambitious by Seth. Oh yeah, but when is Raptor Foo's not ambitious? Sorry, I, I just listened to the announcement. <laughs> but it's about Wiimotes. Oh, the littlest charge shot and the down tilt. Because, yeah, I actually, sh I think I, I don't know if I played friendly with Butt Rumbler. I'm sorry, Australia. Australia. That, he, was, he was Butt Rumbler. That was his old tag. That was his old tag. Uh, but a lot of the time, characters like Samus or Zero Suit even, they'll do an immediate option. Out of out of ledge, they'll like jump and like they'll like uh, tether or they'll do like jump and an air, stuff like that. While Kevin Falcon can just like beat it by down something, and even if he trades, yep. you win. Yeah, so. got to be a little careful. Ca Captain Falcon is actually pretty solid at guarding tether recoveries too. Yeah. If he knows where you're gonna be, um, I've seen a lot of Falcons get that down air out. Yes. Just it's a big down tethering. air, man. Because there's nothing, there's nothing threatening the down air when you tether uh, to ledge. So if a falcon has a read on where you're gonna be, nice up beat. Kind of beating out the neutral air. He hit him between the two hits. It's kind of nice. Kind of nice. What? The? Whoa! Seth staying in shield, assuming that like. I think was he stayed in shield and yeah. yeah he, he stayed in shield until Estrella grabbed to see if he would do it. Yeah, it was a real interesting option out of disadvantage. Estrella definitely chose that, like, thinking 
he's not going to react to this quick enough, and Seth definitely did not. Oh, going I, high. Yeah, I like that high recovery. He knew it, like he knew that setup was just too perfect for covering low recoveries, and it's so tempting to uh, to go for it and just hope they go low. But Seth knew better. He did. Wow. What? I think that was the um the the hand reaching to grab the ledge because kept Falcon's yeah, it had, No, it had to be. But like, wow, I've seen some. I've seen some crazy things hit Falcons <laughs> OP, but I've never seen that. I also think you could shoot a lower charge shot if you do the backflip when you short hop with mm. Samus, because your gun's lower than when you're standing. I don't know if that's true, that's just what it seems like what happened. Maybe. I don't know. That's just me assuming. I've never heard that before, but that's just me assuming that, that property exists. I, I couldn't say one way or another. Oh, great stuff yeah. from Estrella. That was a fantastic tech, though. So yeah, I definitely tech. needed that to stay in the game. Okay. Back air? No, let's go for the up air. Same as heavy, though. Hard to kill off the top. Ah, with rage, almost killing. Yeah, not on Battlefield, Back but Estrella is still going to catch that landing. And now, we saw, now we're looking at a very different situation than yeah. we were a minute ago. Um, now, Estrella coming off of the two stock, he's got the momentum. He's a little, uh, a little more confident. I've got to imagine. That he has to be out. Game three here. Let it be known. I stole someone's charger cable. Okay. Got him. <laughs> what a grimer. <laughs> yeah, huge grimer. Magic carp jump though, dude. Yeah, I gotta got stay on top of the leaderboard. Gotta stay on top. You gotta stay on top for sure. Just like how both these players want to stay on top of the winner side of bracket uh, in this game three. Oh, oh, my oh, going for the other down air. This is zero to death? Question mark? Almost. It looks like when either player gets momentum, they just keep it for Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I feel, I feel like both of these players are oh, so... Oh, not getting it. Oh, my goodness. That's the Captain Falcon stuff where you don't get the knee and you're not like, oh, you don't get the knee and you go, okay, I can get up here from here, you know? Yeah. You can extend it. He whiffs one button and he's just like, I'll go for a slightly less good button. It'll <laughs> still definitely work. Yeah. A little preemptive on that grab there. Oh my goodness! Fadeaway fair is so good from Samus. Anyone approaches, you're you're getting it. Yeah. Oh, another rollback from Seth. Just hold the shield, man. Samus is a little bit scary against shield just because that charge shot is very intimi intimidating. That's you don't want to sit in shield for too long. Uh, sh uh, the super missile and charge shot breaks shields. Oh, that's true. I have had my shield broken by a super missile before. Advo definitely did that to me one time, and I was like, never, ever, ever again. <laughs> Seth had a great start, but now, now Estrella. Oh my goodness. Got a little greedy with that forward smash. It looks like Estrella knows that Seth can't get much off of grab right now, so he's staying in shield a lot. Yeah, Seth tried for that, uh, the classic Falcon, uh, back air to raptor boost because you try to punish back air, raptor boost reels back, yeah. dodges whatever your option is, and kills you, but uh, Estrella oh not having goodness. it. goodness. And now, like you oh. said, the momentum just putting Estrella in a fantastic lead, but Seth is able to uh, kind of reverse the situation a little bit and find his footing. Yeah. So we'll see what he can make of this. What the? But to explain the momentum in, in uh-oh. In other terms, it's like Seth started fishing for certain options and Estrella knew, so he kept backing up and using charge shot no jump here. and the like. Yeah, yeah God, that was wow. super good from Estrella, recognizing that there was no jump. Yeah, there no, was Estrella nothing Seth could have done, especially with great. the threat of that bomb. That's it. 